What's up everybody? I am back with a new special video. I've been meaning to do this intersection stakeout for a long time, but I never really got around to it until now. So this is the intersection of 51st Avenue and Calgary Trail. It's infamous to me and probably a lot of people in this city, because if you, I don't know if you can see it, that right turn lane there, there are two signs saying that it's a free flow lane and not to cross the double solid white line, as if that weren't obvious enough already. There's a double solid white line that continues for a short distance after that turn, but a lot of people like to stop in the free flow lane and cross the double solid white line to dart across the entire road to try and get to the real Canadian superstore to my left. So, yeah, I will see if I capture any bad drivers here. I'm sure I will, because I've already seen a few before I started recording. Mm, I have a strong feeling this person's gonna stop driving at a crawl. Oh yeah, wait, maybe- no, I think he just saw the sign. This person, too. Oh, looks like it's crossing over. Yeah, I crossed it. I notice though, without drivers behind them, I find people tend to tend to turn really, really slow around there as well. I guess they're reading the signs? I don't really know. But I guess with nobody behind them, you're not really pressured to go quickly, so they make the turn really, really slow, and it looks like they're about to cross a double solid white line. But then they get to about where the signs are, and they suddenly pick up the pace. So I'm like, oh, I guess they were just reading the signs? Or at least they listen to them. A lot of people ignore them. This person's crawling. Oh, he's looking. I think he's gonna cross. No, maybe not. Maybe he saw the sign? No, he's good. Oh, that person's crossing. Oh, they're darting. Oh, yep. Going to the superstore. I probably look suspicious here. This lady's just walking behind my car. She kind of smiled at me, but... I probably... I probably look suspicious here. People are just like, what the hell is this guy doing? Just parked there? The car's not even on now, so my lights aren't on now. Anyways. I mean, I guess it probably just looks like I'm parked, like any ordinary civilian. Kind of in an odd spot, but... Parked? Oh, this person's... I guess they figured it out. Nope, they crossed it. Lots of people have little wee syndrome on this road, I find, too. I guess because it's pretty wide. Oh, this person's completely stopped. Oh, yeah, they've, they're at a complete stop in a free flow lane. Cross? Well, I wasn't even going to the superstore, he just wanted the lane next to it. There wasn't really any point of that. There's a double solid line crosser. What about this person? He appears to be going slow. Oh no, he seems to have figured it out. I mean, call me an asshole or a prick, but... I find it odd that people feel the need to slow to a crawl, and just so they can read the sign. At least that's what it appears to be the reason for. I mean, they're not holding anybody up, but I just find it odd that they don't recognize the signs from a distance. Especially the one for the free pull lane, because that has a picture with it. And I think it's a given as soon as you see the double solid white line that you're not supposed to cross it. At least for me it's obvious. Well, someone just did the opposite. I don't know if the camera caught it. They were on the main road, but then they crossed the double solid white line to change lanes to the right, so they could turn into that gas station there, that 7-Eleven in Esso. I heard a beep too. I think someone was beeping at them because they're like, no, what are you doing? You can't cross there. Why are you slowing everybody down? Oh, there's a crosser. An inverse crosser, I guess I could call it, because that's the opposite of what normally happens. Did that make any sense at all? This person's crawling. I feel 
see if they're going to cross. Oh, they're stopping. They are practically stopped. Don't even have a blinker on. Oh, they just put their left blinker on. They are stopped in a free... Someone's coming up behind them. Yeah, you better move. I can usually tell when they're about to do do something illegal or stupid when they're crawling. Like that guy is. And he has his left blinker on. Yeah, that... He wants to go to the superstore. Personally, I think that other person should have headlights on. It's getting pretty dark out. I think that's the same lady that walked by earlier. I probably look even more suspicious now, because she's still coming this way. I'm still just sitting here. Car off, but I'm just sitting here. Doing nothing. I'm looking ahead. I probably look ridiculously suspicious. Oh, this guy's stopping. Going really slow. Oh, I... I don't know why... Oh, and he's just turning into the gas station. I don't know why he started going so slow. I think he was going, like, maybe 10 or 15. Oh, that guy crossed the line. I don't know. I don't know why they go so slow. It just seems very strange to me. I mean, they're not holding anybody up, but I just find it odd. This is entertaining. <laughs> I'm a little creeped out, though. Not creeped out enough to leave, though. I still want to get some more clips. I think I just heard her say, there's a guy in the car right there. <laughs> oh, this person's stopping. Oh, now they're going. Is this a taxi? That is a taxi, yeah. I thought he was going to cross the line. Oh, but he didn't signal his turn into the gas station. I was just thinking, those people behind me, I feel a little bit creeped out by them, but they probably feel really creeped out by me as well. So, oh, what's going on in front of me? Sweet Jesus. I want to apologize if it's getting a little bit dark for you guys to see. Oh, this person is... Yeah, they crossed to go changing lanes to the right. They want to go into the S, though. Oh, this person's got a left blinker on. Yep, they're darting. This person's stopping. Ah, uh, they gave up. What the hell are they doing? They're just stopped there. Some garbage, garbage men near here too. They've got the reflective vests on. I remember wearing them at my old workplace. Holy shit! I think they're racing. Oh, he crossed it. Damn. Wasn't even going to superstore. I'm pretty sure the turnoff for the white mud is pretty. Not too far south of here, too, so some of the people crossing the line, they probably just want to get to the white mud. They want to go eastbound. I'm pretty sure, at least, you have to turn left to go east on the white mud. I can't remember for sure, though. More speed demons. Joke's on them. Gas prices are going up, and they're just wasting their precious fuel by doing that shit. Christ, did the camera catch that? There. There goes another Superstore Chaser. I think it closes at 11 anyway, so after that I wouldn't get any clips of people darting across the double solid white line. <laughs> She's like, oh my god, he's still in that car. 
She's like, what the hell? No. Okay, well, it's getting late. It's getting close to 11. The volume of traffic is waning. That's where I'm going to end this stay camp. But thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Oh, that guy just crossed the line. And he has no life on. But anyways, thanks for watching the stakeout. Um, if you have any more suggestions for a special video, please let me know. We got pedestrians here too. Going for their McDonald's run. Anyways, 